just um, responding to the uh, adversity. You know, when things go downhill, you know, we just don't know how to uh, respond to that. And so that's something that we're going to have to be able to do, down, especially down in Indiana, to get to the bottom and place. And you know, we're going to have to fight through adversity there for sure. Did the runs feel more severe on the road? I mean, obviously you started out good against Iowa and Nebraska, but you know, those runs at the end, I guess you couldn't overcome. Did that feel a little bit more severe with the crowd? Yeah, absolutely, especially playing the Big Ten. You know, it's real physical. Uh, a lot of calls don't go your way on the road, so you, know, you just got to put your head down and fight through the adversity and keep keep grinding, you know, stay together, and you know, I think we're going to be able to do that too. Was this break good for you guys to have, maybe get a little time off? I mean, I know you guys are still in the gym and things like that, but kind of get away from that. Yeah, for sure. Uh, for sure, definitely felt good on our bodies, you know, just to be able to get a rest from you know, playing that long stretch we had. Um, but, you know, we're ready to get back to work and we're going to get ready to get back. How much more helpful was it for you, especially playing more minutes with Mari and I out right there behind you and that kind of thing? I mean, your legs feel extra rest and come on. Oh yeah, uh, I feel pretty good. My body feels pretty good. So, you know, give it to, uh, credit to my uh, trainer and staff, you know, for helping me get to keep my body right. Obviously, things change over the course of the season. What did you like specifically defensively? You guys did the last time you finished up with the Wizards here. Yeah, um, actually, uh, I wasn't too happy with the performance defensively. You know, we gave it 79 points, you know. So, you know, that's kind of characteristic of us. So, you know, we got to do better than that. That's what we're looking for. You know, we know the new players, you know, they play really well together. Really good players. They're really high level players. So, we got to do something. Mario doesn't have his crew on. I guess how helpful will it be to have him get out back soon? Yeah, for sure. Really, really helpful. You know, he just comes in, knows how to run things. You know, it may not show up in the box score, but it shows up, you know, in all of our eyes. You know, we all see what impact he has on the team. No, we're, we miss him so much, but we can't wait for him to get back. Have you seen Marcus continue to, to develop and step up in a role late this season? Yeah, for sure. You know, Marcus has been developing really well. You know, he's just kind of getting a hundred down. He's getting a real feel for it. So uh, he's he's coming up with a lot of loose balls. You know, finds for our offense in the league, defensive league. So that's what we love to see out of him. You know, if he could just be more of a threat on offense, you know, his game is going to be really really good. What's the Arena. I know you've played in a lot of the arenas, but that, that one's pretty cool. Yeah, uh, you're talking about the Hall? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, you know, the first time I stepped into it, I didn't realize how big it was. I uh, realized how high the, the stands went. And, you know, the first time I ever played on the floor, I was just amazed because, you know, I used to watch that place and, and, you know, as, all the time as a kid. So, you know, just to be able to step on the floor, you know, that's a real blessing for a kid like me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.